No doubt there's plenty of money to be made in the cash flow industry, but often it takes more than money to make men rich. Meet Bob and Carol Courtney from the wheat capital of the world, Wellington, Kansas. The two say they are people persons, and through cash flow, they are empowered to help neighbors in the rural community. After training with the American Cash Flow Corporation, Bob and Carol made $13,000 on their first cash flow deal. Confident they could make more cash flow deals, they turned their sights on the needs of Wellington. We like to help others. That's our main goal, is to help others succeed in their needs and wants. When we're doing it right, it's it's a win-win. Bob and Carol currently work in cash flow on a part-time basis. By day, Bob works at the downtown courthouse as a Sumner County Commissioner. Sumner County Commission prejudiced the zoning issue and denied due process. As an elected official for Sumner County, Kansas, Bob Courtney stresses the importance of integrity and high ethics in any business. That's why he chose to be part of the cash flow industry. Given your position at the county, ethics are important to you. Nothing's higher. I believe that my word is all I have. People in this community know me as someone that is very excited about economic opportunities in Sumner County. That's what my career as county commissioner has been about, and that's what my business is about. At the end of the day, isn't it a lot about helping people? It is. Bottom line, if someone wants the line of credit, they got to have it. Right. This is something but, you can help them with. Exactly. Exactly. While Bob spends his days working for the county, his wife, Carol, runs the Wellington Municipal Airport. Hi, Ryan. The uh, Wellington winds are 13 knots southwest, favoring 17 out to According to Carol, if you want to help a town grow, begin at the airport. Before moving full time into cash flow, Carol is spending her last days on the job developing a new runway. More airplanes mean more people to spend more money in Wellington. But it's helping hospitals that became Carol's passion. The American Cash Flow Corporation led Carol to a niche in medical receivables and, so far, three area hospitals and a clinic have stayed open with her help. You actually started with something you were very passionate about and actually made a business out of it. I work mainly with the rural hospitals. They often cannot meet the needs of the local people. Rural America can't afford to lose their hospitals. And if we can help them to sustain and have a positive cash flow every month, that's what we want to do. It's been said, to be happy at home is the result of all ambition. For Bob and Carol Courtney, their ambition is their home.